YouTube and welcome back to our Let's Build Red Rocket. So, what I call a good day, one that ends without an empty stomach. Well, you've got food, so what are you whinging about? Right, so everybody's talking to me. So, uh, last week on Red Rocket, we built this nice little medical shack. I now have it manned. Um, I did find out that I'd actually, I've had to change it a bit because um, originally, no, no, I'm fine. <laughs> um, uh, I found out that it hadn't saved. So I had to rebuild that and now there's some extra bits and pieces. Um, so, I'm looking for trouble, I hope. I, I'm to, right, so, um, the next plan that I have. Uh, oh, oh. I was, I am gonna, re why are you like that? Because you are. I am gonna rebuild the hotel over here, hopefully, um, with the bar area. Here's the barracks. Now I'm really proud of this bit, next bit, because I have I've put down a conduit for the first time. I hate conduits. I've had to hide them. I tried to put it on the ceiling. It just would not work. So the conduits are on the floor. Really proud of that. And then we got out here, which is going to be our shower and bathroom complex. Um, but the biggest thing that I'm really proud of, I say proud, I just figured out that it works, is you can use the stuff that comes in the Far Harbour or I think it's contraptions. Contraptions is where you get warehouses and essentially warehouses and barns are exactly the same things, just reskinned. And if you put one of them, clip one of them to the floor, uh, you can then clip one underneath no matter how big or small it is. So this still actually looks like it's not going to fall over now there's an extra bit, though I could kill keep building outwards and I know a lot of people do but we're gonna see how it goes because in here there is one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven eighteen beds I think nineteen maybe one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve fifteen yeah there's nineteen beds um, and you can go up to 36. So, anyway, up here is the gardening patch where the food comes from. Now, there is also, like I said before, I really, really, really want for every single one of my, um, settlements to have, like, this, um, uh, church space. Um... I don't want to make it big. Do we want to make it big or do we want to make it fairly small? I messed up here, didn't I? Mm, yes, yes I did. Alright, so I can't... I could... Do it kind of... No, that's the wrong way around. Like that? No, that's a bit... Yeah, because then... Nope, that went the wrong way around. Nope. <sighs> so I got rid of the cats today, and then Liara woke up. But Liara is in the front room with me, so I can't really change how that works. So, actually, if we make this just like this... I am going to do a little graveyard down there somewhere. I'm not sure where yet. Or maybe I'll go do a sky coffin one. I am not sure. Uh. Now, the reason I'm putting these everywhere is because otherwise settlers fall off and then they take damage and they whine at you. and Or, or even worse, you fall off and you take damage and you die and then you're like, oh, why did I do that? So... Um, plus the fact it means that all of the stuff that I built when trying to build the walls and it didn't look great. Yeah. 
Hey, look how cool. I'm so proud of those now. Um, right, so we want... I want a door. We don't want a large door, I don't think. Or do we want a large door? Do we want a large door or do we want a small door? Let's see, can we do a large door on just... Yes! Oh, wow! I think, actually, we have our door. Because if I do that, and then I do... That, like that. And I've got to come out so I can open the door. Hmm. Do we even want a door, really, considering how... I don't know. I think what we'll do is we'll get rid of that door. <sighs> Come on game, speed up, keep up with us. Right, there we go. Okay, cool. So, now this one we do want to do the vaulted roof. Roof? Roofs. Roofsicles, that's what we want to do because it makes a lot more sense. Yeah, we want to, we wanted it to be this size, I think. No, we don't want prefabs, we want the walls again, please. Now, I couldn't figure out when I first saw this how to actually do these roofs, so I'm a, you know. <laughs> oh no, that's kind of bad. Someone shut the car door outside. Okay, cool. So, it's going to be a rather small, nice little um, intricate build. Not intricate. Um, so, similar to Sanctuary, I didn't get to show you Sanctuary in the end, which is quite sad for me because I'm so proud of how that worked. thing I want to do is I can't remember can you do the signs here where are the signs is that in the power no it's that's not what I was after I kind of want just a plain board to write stuff on that's not can't really what I was after Mmm, no. Okay, cool. You'll see what I mean in a minute. Anyway, so... Um... Right. So, nope, I don't want that. We want... What we're going to do is we're going to have the little harvest altar that we had in um, Sanctuary. We're going to do it slightly raised up. I think I did it on one of the... I actually just... We don't want it to be too big. Why won't you do this? Normally you can put floors on top of floors. Oh, you can. It's just being silly. Hmm... Right. Okay. Oh, Liara's starting to get <laughs> I should have made sure she was quiet beforehand, really, shouldn't I? Right. So, what we want to do... Do we want a little half bit? Oh. I did not... Oh, wait, that's not the... Right, so... Where's that gone? Trying to clip in with other things. I don't want you to clip. How did I do it at Sanctuary? I did it in a really cheesy way. I did use one of these floors. Wait, you know what? 
I said I was going to try not to use um, place anywhere because that's one of the reasons why I can't go to Sanctuary. But you know what? I think this kind of calls for it. So, I'm going to put this bit right kind of there. And then we're going to Is it that one that I was using? No, I don't need shelves, it's a table. I believe I did something like that, didn't I? Mm. Right, let me see what I can find in the other bit. Yeah, that was one of them. I'm pretty sure that was one of them. Because that's too high, I think. No, it's just that being a bit weird. Actually, that fits. And then... The other thing that we were using is kind of like the oil lamps to light it. And we want to move that a little bit towards the middle there then. I want now what did I use to decorate it? I'm pretty sure it was. No, wait, it wasn't. It was... It was... No. Excuse me. I do know what I'm doing. I, I'm pretending to know what I do. I'm doing... Shh. No one needs to know that I'm lying to them. Right. I'm pretty sure that I did something like that in the middle. Did I use OC Decorator? No, we want food. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure we had all sorts of food and veg and stuff lying around. Well, not necessarily lying around. Yeah, there's definitely some carrots. No, don't fall on the floor. Yeah. Thought I had some flowers. Oh, that one just didn't want to behave. Okay. And then we want our seats. Now this is a small settlement, which is why I'm not using a huge amount of them. Was it this one that gives you the... Yeah, the airplane seats. Yeah, we're gonna only make it two rows deep so you can walk down and get Now, I'm not Catholic in any way, shape or form, but I really like the idea of confessionals, but in the, like, the future it's not necessarily about confession, it's about just, like, talking to someone. 
like I'm feeling depressed and things are going wrong and I need to I need to talk to someone and that's what the the priest or priestess or whatever you want to call her is here and they just talk to you make you feel happy or make you feel like you've got someone on your side all the time which I've always thought is nice the idea that you just go and talk to someone I just will have that And then we'll have that one there. Yeah, they have, um, so unlike in Sanctuary where there's a nasty, well, not necessarily nasty, but not as good um, kind of thing uh, going on between uh, the priest or priestess and all that kind of thing. Um, I like the idea of here because it's the Minutemen training ground. Everyone gets treated a little bit nicer. And there is a reason why this is gonna be here if I can get it to work. You know, you need it to get a ha. Wait a minute, come on. There we go, because I need that now. Come on. Jump. Okay, once again we're gonna have to use place anywhere. Traitor? Why have I messed it up again? I've messed it up again. Oh, God. Right, there we go. And then... No, oh, we want... We're going all the way out here. Oh, wait. All decorations. Miscellaneous. And we'll stick with the red theme, because we've got red in here. So, what we do then? is just hang a couple of curtains on this railing here. Oh, you're not gonna... There we go, like that. And one more. One more, please. There. Oh, you... There we go. And yeah, there we go. So there's the curtain for the confessional. Okay, it doesn't go all the way down, but you know what? It doesn't need to. Oh, let's fix this, actually. There we go. Oh, well done. That's nice. There we go. Okay, and then over here. Now, in Sanctuary, they've got the giant lions because, you know, um, they were supposed to represent the past, which is what they do. But we can't have the lions really here. That one's a bit shot up. See, it just won't fit. Oh, it will fit, but I don't really want that there. Mm, nope, that's too big. They're all too big. I really like these. I got them on the church in um, Sanctuary. No, it's... Um, where is she? It's her. She's on the side of the... Sanctuary Church. Maybe I should put her there, but that might seem a bit too extreme. So, no, we're not going to do that. And yeah, we don't need Liberty Prime, <laughs> because we are not with the Brotherhood. Admittedly, we haven't chosen a side yet, but as you can probably tell, you know who I'm going to go for. So, we will put this in here. Or do we think that's a bit too much? You know what, I think it is a bit too much. So, I wanted to kind of do a whiteboard thing, so you can have a white block there and post your name up, like the names of um, the heroes of Red Rocket, which would basically be my Patreon supporters, if I get around, if I ever get anyone. And uh, they'll be going on the wall just there, I think. Yep, yeah, I think that'll do. Um, I actually want to go for miscellaneous. Mm. 
I got Venetian blinds, but not not exactly what I was after. Whoops. You can see what I'm trying to do here. Actually. Why are you not showing up? Oh, that's a giant one. Don't want a giant one. I'm sorry, sometimes I forget where everything is because it goes a bit like, oh yeah, you wanted to do this, didn't you? And he doesn't give you the candles that he says you do because you can get candles in this. There we go. No, no, it was it was that one. Sorry, guys. I do know what I'm doing, honestly. I just want the standard minute men will know. Oh God. USO integrated. It's such a pain in the backside at times. We want wall flags, please. putting it there we go. That's better. Yeah. Nope, I didn't want to do whatever I picked up. I'm sorry I didn't mean to. Right. And that was the other thing we were gonna do, which is Um Yeah no we were gonna do portraits. It was gonna be along the lines of Come on, please. Ah, oh. and the same Minutemen pictures that you get downstairs in the barracks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, kind of like saying thank you to all those that. Yeah, it's a form of ancestor worship, is the way I kind of figure it to be. Kind of maybe more along the lines of Shinto religion than anything else. There we go. So that wall's being left blank until I figure out how to make my own signs. And then, um, yeah. So there's our little church. So um, if you have any ideas that you'd like me to do in Red Rocket, then please let me know. Um, I ho do hope that you have enjoyed this video. So if you do, please like and subscribe. And I shall see you next time. Um, and take care. Goodbye.